Everybody, it's Carol. I'm going to do a uh, spiral pour today. I'm trying a uh, bare um, house paint, bare enamel. It's, this is a very light, light gray that I had around. So it's a bare enamel with some Floetrol. Um, I'm going to use uh, some Liquitex Basics. I'm just going to add a little bit of that to this. <clears throat> I don't know what it'll turn out like, but we'll see. I don't like it. I'll balloon smash it. Okay, I'm gonna I'm just gonna put some white paint around the edges. This is just an 8x10. I just wanted to use a small one just to try it. Okay, where did I put my there it is. It's just to help it run off the edge better, quicker. You can do it without, but I like a little bit on here. So I have my little measuring cup here. And this takes about four ounces, but with this um, technique, I don't think I need quite four ounces, especially with this white paint. So I've got some um, Dioxin Purple Basics, I've got Cobalt Blue Basics, Brilliant Artist, Brilliant uh, Magenta, the Artist Loft, and some Copper. So I think I'll just put some purple in the bottom. So I have a lot of paint. Can see this cup. Let me just move this out of the way. <clears throat> then I'll pour this. Then I'll do some. Uh, I'll do magenta next. The consistency is thinner than normal. It doesn't make a puddle, puddle when you stir it. I'm going to put some copper next. This is pretty runny, this copper. So we'll see. <clears throat> some cobalt blue. A little bit of this house paint. Um, I'm gonna put the rest of the magenta in. rest of the purple in. I'm 
These are pretty, pretty colors. A little more of the enamel. 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 Uh, I think I'll do the cold. I'll do some of the copper. I'll do the rest of the cobalt blue. Oops. Now some of this gray enamel. Sinking there. And I think that's probably enough. Maybe a little bit more. And I'm just going to... I'm going to swirl it. No, you know what? I'm going to straight pour. Oh, I should have used a bigger canvas. These colors are so awesome. Together. I think the straight pour, the colors flow on top of each other better. Quite enough paint. <clears throat> well, look at that action there. I think the metallics help. Go off first. I'm go down to this corner now. Wow. Well, 
that's pretty. Look at that. Wow, I'm gonna take my torch and get the air bubbles out. <sighs> I think it's very cool. Purple here, blues are here, and the, the magenta and the copper look really nice here. Look at those cells. I'll hold it up. It's like cells in cells. So I'm going to do this one again on a bigger canvas. I like it. I love it. No balloon smash here. All right. Thanks for coming by. Please check out the description below and uh, join our Facebook group. Post your pictures. Try some of my techniques and show me. So this is a spiral pour, or actually it's a straight pour with some uh, bare enamel paint in it. It's very cool, very cool. Thanks for coming by. See you next time, have a great day, bye bye. Hi everybody, I'm here looking at my dried painting. Dried really smooth. I love that copper and the purple together. So that's with the bare enamel. Thank you. Bye-bye. Have a great day.